take one to this. So, Arch Linux, it's a pretty common theme of my channel. And yeah, so someone suggested that I install the very first version of Arch Linux from, wait, when was it? 2002, 11th of March, 2002. So yeah, we're gonna be installing the very first Arch Linux version from 2002. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, here we go, we're on the laptop. And I found this really helpful guide on GitHub on how to do this. So installing Arch Linux 0.1 with X11. First up, we need an image. All right, now we have an image. So let's open up virtual machine. I don't have it. And now we have virtual machine manager. Um, unable to connect. Make sure an appropriate libvirt the daemon is running. Well done. All right, I enabled one. And all right, there we go, LXC. So let's make a new virtual machine. Oh my gosh, this is different. I want an operating system container. What? Oh wait, is it because I don't have QE? Oh yes! I don't have QEMU. Oh well, I did it. Let's get rid of this connection. Disconnect. Oh, yeah, there we go. So let's make a new forward. Oh uh, yep, that'll do, that'll do. All right, I've messed with everything. Begin. Oh. Oh, what is this? Lilo! 22.2 boot. Um, and, oh! Enter! Alright, we're booting. We're boot. oh. Alright, well we're off to an amazing start. We got a kernel panic! That's... That's just great. Alright, so it says that the tutorial has been tested on VirtualBox. So let's try it on VirtualBox. And here we go, here's VirtualBox. So let's make a new virtual machine, Arch Linux 0.1. Set my ISO to that one. Set it back to 32 bit. Yes, yes. Um, let's go uh, 16 gigs next. Finish. Let's see, what can we change in the settings? The storage. Like control is SATA, can we make a new? Why is it all great? Oh, yeah, because we already have an IDE controller. Okay, and we're going to start. Oh. oh. Oh, oh, okay, I'll run this. Come on. All right. All right, we're logging back in. Let's see if this works. Um, virtual box. Start. Oh, oh, yes, yes. Alright, Lilo. I don't care. Enter. Booting the kernel. Nice. Work. I do not have a right control button. I do not have a right control button. I need to change this. Host key combo. Control. Control Alt. Alright, there we go. Hey, now it works. Alright, now it's big enough so that you can actually see. So we're going to log in as root. Clear the screen and cf disk slash dev slash hda. Yes. Now we're going to make a new primary. Uh, right. Yes. Oh my gosh, this is old. I just realised. This is so old. Okay, bootable. Quit. Um, make. What? What is that file system? R e i s e r f s. Slash dev slash hda1. Oh, uh, attention, you should reboot. Yes. Alright, we're back. So we'll log back in as a root and make the dash p pacman touch dot db install world slash mnt. Oh! 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 Okay! Oh! Done! Okay! Um, pacman. Dash A, dash R. Can I just do AR? No, I can't. File system. I uh, cannot extract. 
Okay, well, I guess it already installed. So, make the dash p slash mnt slash user slash source. Wait, what are we compiling? I have no idea. Oh, oh, okay. I think we're compiling the kernel. I think we're compiling the flipping kernel. Time zxvf. Yep, we're compiling the kernel. Oh, I think we're in. I think we are attributed in. So cd user source linux and then make menu config on. Oh, 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 we're in here. So we need to enable the following options. Code maturity level of, of what? Never seen this. Oh my gosh, but this kernel is ancient. Version 2.4.18. This is from 2002, so... Anyway, that one, accept, accept, yes, save, make, that. Oh, I think we're compiling. I think we are compiling the kernel. Wow, this is actually going really fast. Oh my gosh, it's done. Anyway, uh, make bz image. There we go. Well, that was fast. Make modules install. Um, cp arch bz image um cp system dot map um vi i don't know how to use vim i have no idea how to use vim quit vim quit vim i entered the bootloader oh my gosh i knocked my camera lilo Let's change root dev disks disk zero part two to dev disks disk zero part one Wait, do I have the insert? I don't have an insert button. How do I insert? How do I insert in Vim? Ah, oh, so I press the I button. Okay. I. Insert. Okay, part one. Escape. Now I command WQ. There we go. So we have written that Lilo. Oh wait, not a not a number. What? Then he found the type two instead of one and fixed it. Screw it, holds differ. Added arch. Add these lines to your fstab config. Okay. So we can dev this part one. Right, there we go escape right and reboot oh yeah there we go rebooting oh yes oh yes lilo boot oh it just did it oh my gosh come on well i think we found our problem all right let's see does this work Oh, yeah, we got the Lilo boot menu. And we're booting. Oh my gosh! Look at that! We've installed Arch Linux 0.1. Okay, no way. I haven't logged in yet, so we're going to root, root. We're in! We're in! We're in! Network is unreachable. Okay, so we don't have um, network access. But you know what we can do? Install X11. Mount slash... Oh, I need I need CD-ROM. Oh, yep, I have CD-ROM. Dev CD-ROMs is right protected. I right, Pac-Man X3. There we go. Run XF config. XF86 config. Then press enter. Select type PS2 mouse. Um, VI slash ETC slash X11. Go to line 351. There, driver VGA, and it says to change it to. Oh, I need to insert. So let's change it to VESA. Save that. And then start X. What? Oh, what? Oh 
my gosh! Whoa, 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 wait, what is this? Uh, virtual box, what is this? Mouse integration, does not support. Well, this is it! We're in, we've done it! We can drag stuff, we can quit stuff. How do I quit? I don't know. Exit, exit. Would you look at that? We have Arch Linux with TWM. And there's only one more thing left to do. You serious? Okay, LTS is 6.12, good. All right, well it shows up. All right, let's see. Oh my gosh, it mounted. Let's see if VirtualBox works on its own kernel. Alright, we're rebooting back into the other kernel. Oh my gosh, did it not write? I don't think it wrote. He must specify the fastest type. Oh my gosh. Now, can I true root into this? Oh my gosh, I can! There's no ls slash bin slash neo fetch. Oh, I'm giving up. This is way too old. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like. If you have something to say, leave a comment. And if you want to see more, subscribe. And a huge thanks to my channel members, Woecrafter, Mr. Denia, Soft, Lovely, Lullapalooza, and Alice GD. And I'll see you in the next one.